Hello YouTubers. I just want to share this video. If you guys are having trouble with uh, service stability track and lack of power, I got an 09 Chevy Silverado and it just did this on me today. I was driving it down the road pulling my trailer and all of a sudden I got this. Never expected from a Chevy. I had a 2001 and man it ran great. And I got this 09 and I've been you know I, I haven't been too happy with it but now I got this. I got this issue now service traction control. So uh, as you can see I got the accelerator I press it down all the way down and I don't want it it doesn't want to it doesn't want to accelerate at all so I got it at home and I put the uh, I put the scanner on it to see what was wrong with it maybe I could get some codes or something So there's a TPS. The, th the first thing that I got was, uh, let me go back to, there you go. The first thing that I got was the code P1516. So I didn't know what was going on. And then it showed throttle actuator control. Module throttle actuator position performance. TAC. So the first thing that came to mind was the, uh, the throttle position sensor, right? So I went down all the way to where it says TPS. There you go. I pressed down the accelerator all the way down. Press down the accelerator all the way down and nothing happens. What? Nothing happens. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and check it out. Hopefully I can, uh, I can find what the deal is here. So, uh, but anyway, this isn't the greatest scan tool. It's a, it's one from a Inova. But man, it, it 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 pulls you out of a bind. It pulls you out of a bind. It has for me on my uh, recent vehicles. But uh, anyway, going back to uh, going back to this problem. If anybody has this problem. Uh, please comment on the video below. So, I already got the cover off. But, uh, I'm gonna start checking that one. I'm, this whole thing right here, I'm probably gonna take it apart. Or, probably gonna take it apart or look at the cable. That's the cable right there. I don't know if you guys can see it well. I'm gonna... Well, I'm kind of feeling the wires and they don't... They feel like they're kind of loose right there on the on the very end of the connector. So I could have a faulty wire or something. And, uh... Man, this sucks. I just really wasn't expecting this from a Chevrolet. No. Anyway, I'll keep you posted. I'll do a second video on this ordeal. See what's going on. But uh, it's not, I don't think it's gonna be fun. Whether it's the uh, throttle position sensor or, or a wire. I hope it's the throttle position sensor. Otherwise it might be the computer. And if it's the computer, man, oh, 
I, 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 I hate to spend a couple hundred dollars. I don't know how much that thing's going to be. But anyway, uh, I'll keep you guys posted on this video. And, uh, you know, if you guys have the same problem, I mean, share your comments or whatever. And uh, I'll probably do a part two on this video to see what was, what was the deal with it. But anyway, there you go. You see how now it's accelerating now. So, man, I don't know what's it gonna be, but probably a faulty wire or something. It's it's accelerating now, but not all the way to the. Not all the way to the bottom. Not all not all, not full throttle anyway. And uh, I don't know, guys. Just leave your comments below and uh, I'll, I'll take a look at them. And uh, God bless you and I'll, I'll see you on the next video.